in this video we're going to install the angle kit in our BMW I removed the other wheel already but you can see look at the angle this is everything so it's all to the passenger side to the right and let's see how much will that be when we are done and look how much clearance we have <laughs> we have a oh wow wow look at that it was hitting there because it was too low that's why I've been screwing my tires when I drift. All right, so you see this here? So this is the part that goes to the steering wheel and this is the part that goes to the lower control arm. What we're going to do is we're going to move the part that goes to the steering wheel to this other hole and we are gonna use the bolt that was provided, which is a weird bolt, in here. So this is going to hold this guy here in place and this is going to move there but I'm having a trouble to take this out of here because it doesn't want doesn't not want to get out so I'm gonna try maybe to heat it up and see what happens all right we have the whole crew today that's it one and two they're not helping though <laughs> so finally I took that thing out of here Kai, you helped me, right? No. Did you help me? Nice. Okay, so this is out here. I guess I need to get closer. This is out, and that is unscrewed. So, what I need to do is I need to put this right in here getting cold can you can you get a couple of those here for me here one of one of this can you get this big one? Oh, that one and one of those okay. all right so Kai's giving me a hand now can I have it and yeah, yeah it's all good problem put it in it's a problem right so this goes in here where the thing was before and nice and now what's gonna give us the angle is this guy here so uh, I've seen before we might we might need to cut a little bit of this and uh, yeah, all right, so I'm gonna tie those guys a little bit. Uh, maybe use the, uh, I can't quite tell how it's going to be, uh, but definitely, I will need to shorten this thing here. All right. This is going to take forever because uh, I can't fit uh, the 21 millimeter in there. So, it's going to take a while. Um, there's one thing we gotta do that I did on the other one, but it wasn't enough. So see this here? This is the inner tie rod. You gotta cut that nut, that bolt, a lot. Uh, I hope you can see there's sunlight and stuff, but you gotta cut it a lot because if you don't, if when I put the wheel on, it was like, the steering wheel was straight, but this thing here wasn't, was like this. And this means that because I relocate 
because we need to relocate the uh, tie rod from here to here we lose this space so we gotta cut this space from that nut so what I did is I took this out and I count 24 threads and I cut that off here first I cut only six threads which wasn't enough so I'm gonna cut all the same ones to be exactly the same on the other side and another note is we cut part of this so we can thread it out thread it up thread it in all the way in uh, we are going to put this guy in there so what I'm going to do is the steering wheel oh I gotta put this in here before I forgot this is not there we go there the little nut Need to hide this. There you go. Nice. So the steering wheel is straight. This seems to be straightish. So I'm not sure. Uh, might need to do one little turn look for it up here it's tiny bit to the inside and this here this here is kind of good just like that 75 hours later I have that thing straight steering wheel was straight and I'm happy. I guess it's, uh, it's much more than we had before. Uh, we, we're we good. It's not touching anywhere. I guess. Or it's touching just a tiny bit. We might need to put some spacers. But I guess it's good for now. On the next video, we're going to install the coilovers. Um, I also have new sticker, but I'm not going to put that now. So next video coilovers, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button and I'll see you in the next video guys.